The next part is just to connect the wiring of the board. The orange wire goes to there. The red wire goes to there. And you just snap it right in. There's no thinking involved. It's just a little board. You put it on. No need to be intimidated. So you could just put those wires right in. And uh, if you look at the instructions, it's really easy. So and now we'll do the wiring. You'll see here, there's like an M. So yellow's first, and the color goes towards the M, and it says M1. Next is orange. And then you get the two blues. M3 and M4, which stands for the motors. M4. And then the last one is for the LED, which is the light. And that's M, or L. You'll see it says an L. It stands for LED, I believe. And there you go. Yellow, orange, blue, blue, red. And that's the wiring. And next will be the remote control. We're almost done. Now we're putting together the remote control. There's a separate PC board. You just put it in, and then you start to, you have like this switch, so you know this side's up, and you have this wire that comes out. And here um, is essentially you'll have contacts, and I'll show you more, but just screw them in with these screws one by one. And I'll come back with it finished. I screwed all the pieces in now. Here you go. That looks pretty good. So I essentially added the top of the remote control. The, the buttons are at the top. And now we're going to test it. Everything's put together. Here is the completed arm. Robot arm, and here is your remote control, and now I'm going to plug it in. Just plugs into the back, right here, and then we're going to test it. So plug it in. Plugged in right there, and now. I'm going to see if it works. Let's... Oh, cool! Let's see. Move down. Move up. Uh-oh. Here, put, put it in. Nice. All systems go. Hey. Go slower. And then lastly, see if the light goes on. Let's move the head up. And then let's see if the light goes on. Oh, the light went on. All tests go. Success. Awesome.